Hey everyone, this is Andy Dark. I'm a content creator, I'm a home chef, and I'm a cooking instructor. So a few weeks ago, everyone was so crazy about that 400 time step on the coffee. And this two weeks is all about that souffle only. And people claim that you need to whip it for a thousand times. Today I'm gonna show you how to do it, and I'm gonna bring it to the next level. So let's get started. So to do this souffle omelette, you only need eggs, salt, and sugars. And first, we need to separate the egg white and egg yolks. So make sure you don't break the yolks. Because if you have the, the fat in the egg white, you can really whip it up. So I have all the yolks here inside a mixing bowl and I'm gonna add some salt to just season it. After beating the yolk for a minute or so, you can see the yolk turn into pale yellow color already. So we can leave them aside and at the same time we can start beating the egg white. Before adding the sugar, we're gonna beat this for 20 seconds. After beating for 20 seconds, you can see you get some foam start forming here. So now you can get some sugar in there and keep beating it until the soft peak stage. Yeah, it's soft peak stage, right? Yeah, soft peak stage. Yeah, keep beating. So how do we know if the egg white is ready is when you flip over the bowl, it's not gonna fall out, so that's ready. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna take some of the egg white and we're gonna mix it with the egg yolk and then we'll put it back and mix it together. So when both egg white and egg yolk totally mix together and we can start cooking. With a non-stick pan, heat up some butter and melt it over low heat. Use a kitchen towel to gently wipe away any excess butter from the frying pan. Pour in the whipped egg white mixture and gently spread them around so it's evenly coating the pan. Cover the lid and cook over low heat for 4 to 7 minutes. After a few minutes, remove the lid and slightly raise your frying pan to around 45 degrees and carefully roll your souffle omelette down and fold it in half. Press it gently in order to seal all the edges and your souffle omelette is ready to serve. This is my version of the souffle omelette but you know for shooting we've been taking photos and stuff so it kind of deflay a little bit already but it's still gonna taste delicious. So if you would like to eat it as a savory dish you can uh, eat it with some cheese or mushroom. Uh, if you want to have it as a dessert you can add icing sugar or like uh, maple syrup anything you like you know. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel please do so. If you have any question please leave in the comment section and I will get back to you as soon as possible. And uh, check out my Facebook page and Instagram. And I will see you all next time. Bye bye.